In this tutorial, we are going to solve the easiest uh, variant of buy and sell stock problem. So the problem statement is given an array of stock prices and at most one transaction is allowed. So uh, design an algorithm to find the maximum profit. So if you see and, uh, and the condition is you can't sell a stock before you buy one. So given an array of stock prices so here's the stock prices and if i have to design an algorithm to find maximum profit so maximum profit in this case is five so if i buy a stock at day one so at this so at at the price of rupees one and sell sell on day five so the day uh, the day five prices is six so 6 minus 1 is 5 so i get the maximum profit if i buy buy on day 2 and sell it sell on day 5 so now only one transaction is allowed at most one transaction is allowed so if we find the maximum difference between two array element then our problem is solved so let's see how we can solve this problem. So here is my function which returns the maximum profit and how I do it. So I have declared two variable mean and max and mean is initialized with integer dot max value. So maximum value is initialized to mean and max is initialized with zero. Now I'm traversing an array and here I have checked a condition if the array element is lesser than the value present in mean variable then assign it to mean variable and if the difference between current element and the minimum element is greater than the max value then assign it to this so let's dry run this code so of uh, I have initialized mean and max and the first array element is 7 so is 7 is less than the mean yes so 7 is initialized so initial value of mean is integer dot max value so whatever the maximum value of an integer is assign it to mean so 7 is assigned here and now the condition is array i so current element so at element present at 0th index is 7 so 7 minus mean and the value of mean is 7 so 0 and the initial value of max is 0 so max is unchanged here now the next value is 1 1 is less than 7 yes so now the new value of mean is 7 uh, 1 and is array i so the current element the value of uh, value present at current index is 1 and value present in mean variable 1 so is it greater than the value present at max so 0 is greater than 0 no so the value remains unchanged again now the next value is 5 is 5 is lesser than the value present in mean and the value present in mean is 1 no so the value remains unchanged here now let's move to next here 5 minus 1 is greater than the value present at max and the value present at max is zero so yes it's greater than that so now the value is four here next the value is three and is three is less than the value present at mean no so it uh, value remains unchanged now next condition is so the current element is three minus the value present at mean which is 1 so 3 minus 1 is 2 is it greater than the value present at max and the value present in max is 4 so no next is 6 so here again the value remains unchanged and 6 minus 1 which is uh, 5 and 5 is greater than the value present in max which is 4 so here we assign a value 5 the next value is 4 and so on and after this loop we return the maximum value which is 5 and in mean method if you see I have declared an array and 
I have called this method and passed the array and I get the result which is uh, which I printed here so if I run a uh, I, if I run this program see my output as 5 so uh, this is the easiest version of buy and sell stock problem and uh, if only one transaction is allowed then we can easily solve uh, this problem using this approach and for more such programming video you can subscribe our youtube channel you can visit our website which is https colon slash slash thanks for watching this video